It's a good song, that. It, uh, it's a bit too short for my taste, though. It's only a minute and a 34 seconds long. Even less if you count the, the dithering. That's all right. The extended version is too much, too. It's like an hour long. That's too much. That's too much, baby. But all right. Uh... You're not you when you Snickers. That's that's yesterday's. Hold on. Um, a worm, and he pukes. Uh, doesn't have to be anything clever. It never had to be anything clever. There, a worm and he pukes. Fucking. Let's check out this game. I have no idea what to expect. But I only have two fishing games left that I can play in recent time. There are more on the wish list. Whoa, that's loud. There are more fishing games on the wish list, though those ones have not gone under. Uh, what the, what's the word I'm after? Um, sale. None of them have gone on to sale yet. And I'm, I'm not paying full price for a lot of those, so... F that. So what's this? That's a T, by the way. Fishing Barnett's Sea. I thought it was an I, so I thought it was Barnes. The Barnes Sea. The Venus. That was loud, yeah. <sighs> this music's actually kind of ominous, isn't it? Apparently there's DLC down there, look. Line and Net Ships DLC and King Crab DLC. King Crab? Okay. All right, this metric, let's take knots, mile per hour. Let's fix some of that so I can read it. Um, why would it let me change it? <laughs> it won't let me change. I can't... I can... What the fuck? What? Uh, that is a... That is a very strange way of changing a menu. What the hell? Uh... Kilometers, miles per hour. Celsius, yeah. Alright, we're good. Start a new career, I guess. Hey, Neb. Hey, Green. King Crab's gonna fuck me up. Yo! Jan Nielsen. Can't I change how they look? What is the female? They both look terrible. Okay, name. Matter, baby. There we go. Why are these people Norwegian? Why are you Norwegian? Huh? Answer me that. Why is this music so fucking ominous? I feel like I'm playing Dead Island. Welcome to the penis sea. Nah, nah, nah. Uh, press Y to switch from first person mode. Okay, this is kind of sick. So, you get to control the boat there. 
Oh shit, look at That's pretty neat. How do I let go? What is that? <laughs> Where's Simonoi? Simonoi. Once you sit in the chair, you can pilot the boat there. Press B to walk around, press Y for third person mode. This is actually pretty sick. I'm not gonna lie, this is neat. This feels like one of those indie survival games, you know? Simonoi really helped you out at the beginning of Dead Island. Dead Island is something I should play someday, but... Not for a while. Oh, I can drive the boat. It's a big boat, though. Drive towards the long line that's been set nearby. You mean the thing on the minimap? This thing is hard to steer. I don't like this music. It's creepy. Makes me feel like something bad's gonna happen. Is Dead Island on Switch? Nah. Though, I think it could run on the Switch. If it was optimized correctly. But that's alright. I already own... Dead Island and it's part 2 sequel slash DLC for PS4. Okay. Haul in the long line. Fuck. <laughs> Shit! How do I U turn a boat? The game itself isn't optimized, but that's why people love it. Oh yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. Hold on, I need to do a big... I need to do a big fucking... Okay. All right. Yeah, I like Dead Island. It's fun. I've played it through many times. There was a point where I knew games that game so much that I was way too powerful. It, it got to the point where I was running through the game just one-shotting every zombie, even the bosses. It was very fun. Okay, coming in for the war sweep. This isn't going to work. Ha! Ah. Slow down! Stop! Please! Oh, I can reverse! Fuck! How do I stop this thing? How do I stop the botte? Oh, fucking Christ. Ugh. Oh, I see it! There's a throttle thing on the side, you see it? Next to the compass? Compass. This is extremely...
This is extremely simulator. This is the most sim fishing game yet. Would you like to haul in the line? Yeah. Sam B is the most broke character. Most health and his fury is OP. Definitely. Red mist, yellow okay, green is good, blue is perfect. Wow, this is just like fishing. This is like industrial fishing. This isn't... This isn't hobby fishing. This is... My job is fishing. The game. This is a very different game to the ones we've played before. Next part. Now you got the fish. Oh my god. Oh my god! Um. Well, from what I've seen on the TV, you start with the throat. How do you... What? Apparently I got the fish. Didn't do shit. Drive towards the second long line. I... I didn't got the fish. That was... It just stopped. I need to learn how to gut the fish. Alright. Fishing as usual, I... I'm trying to gut a fish, Rai, but it's not working. Ah! actually kind of gruesome. We're not gutting anything, we're just sort of... Okay. Let's get back on... Let's get back on the drivey. This game is strange. I'm not sure about this music. It's like... Uh, Red Dead Redemption 2 with the gutting animals. It's very gruesome. I'm glad we're playing the Switch version. Because this is on PC. And I imagine there's like a, an ultra graphics setting. So I imagine... <laughs> imagine the viscera from that. Stock Music 101. It just doesn't make me feel like we're on a fishing adventure. It's very ambient. You know what? Fucking slow the boat down. I don't- I'm not feeling the music. I feel like it's gonna... I feel like it's gonna chase people off. It's nice, it's nice music, but I'm not feeling it. This is the kind of music music I expect to hear from Echo the Dolphin on Dreamcast. It's very similar. How to clean your DVD player videos. <laughs> you know exactly the type of music it is. All right, no tunes. Now let me go grab something that's more fitting for what's going on. Also, I think I've grabbed... I think I've got a bug from something. So I've been doing a lot of bathroom trips, so... If I suddenly vanish and run to the bathroom, you'll know. Alright.
Let's fucking go! Yeah, that was a joke. <laughs> that was a... I'm gonna get copyright claimed for that shit. Uh, sailing... I've been muted this whole time. And I've missed my fish! I need to get rid of... that button being my mute button. I'm gonna do that right now, because I'll, I'll just keep forgetting. Yeah, mute. Let's change it to... What's a key I don't use at all? These, I guess? Unmute. There, uh, apply. Rock and roll. Fish. Okay, now we got the fish. Because this is my job. Imagine my gutting gets better with a better north and a better cutting board. Okay. Drive to the second long line.
Drive towards the second long line that's been set nearby. Where though? I don't see shit. This map is huge. What's that green? It's... Drive towards the second long line that has been set nearby, then hold the line in again with... A I did that though. Right? Oh my god! <laughs> I'm taking on water, it looks like. I don't quite understand... ...the problem here. Can I zoom in? Info. Undiscovered locations. I'll tell you what, I think... I'm very confused. Drive towards the nearest... <laughs> I don't see shit though, Captain! going this does not help me you know what exit to main menu because that was all tutorial I think I get the gist Yeah, start new career. Let's call this one... Nebby. Nibbles. An unfortunate name, but one he has to keep. Starts in Hammerfest. Let's go! Fuck yeah. I'm actually kind of pumped to explore this game. Yo, are we starting in a harbor this time? Fuck yeah, man. Fuck yeah, man! <laughs> There we go. Fish population. That's what I want to see. Shame you can't... Uh, oh, you can place your waypoint. Look at it. Oh, look at it. Fuck yeah. All right, then. We'll... Uh, chimmy out to that part of the ocean right there. Um, Place waypoint. Cannot cross land? Beg your pardon. Huh? Cannot place waypoints over land. I... Uh, um... Okay, sure. Whatever you say, pal.
This is a slow ass boat. You know what? It doesn't matter. I don't need to put a waypoint. I can just simply go there, check the map, and then set my line and do more stuff. What's that doing? Set gear. Oh, there you go, boy. That's how you get work lights, searchlight, horn. Well, it's a bit of a pathetic horn, but pick up radio and call for help. <laughs> weather. It's looking good. Nice weather for it. Line info, storage. Sonar, GPS, fuck. This has got everything you could ever want. I'm impressed, truly. I would wish. Oh, I could change the music. <laughs> Well, the music I have right now is the bet. Er. Okay, let's see if I can place a waypoint now. Yes! Okay, so I'm not allowed to place a waypoint if there's any piece of land in front of me. Not allowed. Alright, let's make our way. I feel like a real fisherman. What is the end goal of this, though? Like, what is... Besides fishing... What is the... What does the game expect me to do at a certain point? Do I need a huge boat? Do I have a crew? Do I end up owning the city? What is it? I'd like a better engine. How fast are we going? Eight miles per hour. It's pretty slow. Still, it's faster than I can walk, so whatever. My goal is to catch Moby Dick. I wish that was the goal. So it looks like this boat increases speed at certain points and then sort of slows down at other points. I don't get it. Maybe it's just the... Maybe it's just my ship. Because it's a rickety rust bucket. You know, it's games like this that make me wish I have like a super powerful computer to see this on like ultra realistic. Because right now we're only on, I think we're on the lowest settings we can get. Still though, I'm actually impressed that the, this game is running smoothly. Like it looks a bit low poly, sure, but that's not really an issue. That's just, you know, it doesn't really matter. This game looks fine. This game looks fine at the resolution it's at. But it does make me wonder, how good can it look? How far away are we? Yeah, we're getting there. We're getting there. 
Sure is taking a long ass time though. It looks like I have plenty of fuel and plenty of whatever that is underneath. I'm not sure what that is. Winch? Winch oil? I wonder what this is like at night time. <sighs> when it's still early morning. We're still within the ninth hour of the day. Oh, we've entered yards. We're getting close to my fishing point. I also wish you had a super powerful computer so you could actually play the Bloodborne like play dogs a game. Yeah. Yeah, that would be good. That would be good. I don't have the money for it. That's a lie. No, I do have the money I could spend on a new computer. But that money isn't for the computer. It's for <laughs> being alive. If I spent all of my savings on a new computer, I'd starve. <laughs> I'd have no money for food. I'll get one one day, though. The price... The price of ultra-powerful PCs does not climb faster than my savings. So eventually, I'll catch up. And I'll be able to afford one without eating into my important money. I just gotta be patient. And besides, I'm in no rush. We're getting close! God, it's taken me an hour to come out to this point. In-game, I mean. An in-game hour. Goodness gravy. Maybe this is how long it takes in real life, though. Maybe this is what fishing is, IRL. Okay, I'm gonna start slowing down the boat there. Oh look! My waypoint is actually a tangible thing, it's right there. Ha! That's cool! It's floating on the water, that's neat. They didn't need to do that. You've arrived at the <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Stop the boat! Yeah. You might upgrade your sub to another tier so you can upgrade my PC. <laughs> you don't need to do that. <laughs> okay. The boat has stopped. And we are in a hot spot of fish population. Now then, let's work out how we do this. Okay. Gear not within range. Okay. What are these? Set gear. Nani? I'm sure if we just start fucking around with a bunch of switches and stuff, good things will happen. Ooh, binoculars. And a compass. 
Open log. What if I do something like this? Set gear. Why does this happen? It goes to a screen. Like I should be seeing something, but I don't. <laughs> a light furnace. That's cool. Rotate searchlight. Mm. I'm confused. I don't know what you want from me. Gamer. What is supposed to be happening? Oh, whoops. The boat's moving. Don't do that. <laughs> gear not within range. Set gear. I... Don't understand. Logbook. See wiki. Sure, let's look up the wiki. Ah, uh, la 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 la. Getting started? Sure. Bait. This section is all about bait type and what bait you need for long lines. I'm not doing lines. Shrimp! Fishing tools. Huh. Uh, uh, you know, a whole... A whole percent, ten percent line is like not a good... All. To use long lines, you need to bait them at port. Okay, what if I don't want to do that? To set the fish fishnet, place at a buoy in the water. Then, keep a steady pace with the boat there while the line is being set. Oh! Okay, hold on, so... If I... Set gear, and then... Is this working? I don't think this is working. Hmm. Was I meant to do something at port? And I fogged up? Welcome to overcomplicated.
fish nets have a different length. Blah blah blah. Oh shit, thanks for the follow. I do not know what I'm doing. Ports. Business and ports. Each port is a variant of services available. Fish market, crew, bank, missions, upgrade, refuel, repair. Buy boats. Local fish, repair. Fish market, mission, repair. God damn it. Something tells me I shouldn't have skipped tutorial. But then again, the tutorial didn't really say much. <laughs> it just kind of got stuck. It kept telling me to do something that I was already doing. Ugh, God, what do I do? How do I do? Oh, that's how you get back to... That's how you get back to the city. That's pretty good. So you call for rescue and it's an instant... Uh... Oh, but you give them money. <laughs> so it's not for free. What's this? Okay, what have we got here? Skip time, map, weather forecast, fish market, town? What is this? Boat services. Crew? Oh my god. You can hire people. I don't have a wage though. Bank. Bar? Oh, thank you. Boat services? Maintenance, upgrades, purchase a boat. Radar. Searchlights. Mast. Go fishing. This, uh, this game kind of sucks for beginners. <laughs> 45 minutes in. You know what I'm going to do? Go back to tutorial. <laughs> I want to play through the tutorial again. Because I didn't quite get it. Start new career. I don't care what his name is. Gotta do this again. Because there's something I didn't quite get. Something that's not obvious by just playing the game. Welcome to blah blah. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. Oh, what? It's on the right side, yeah? So that means I gotta do a big old. Okay, time for a U turn. Now! Go! Ah, da, 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 da. Okay. Slow it down.
Reverse. Ever so carefully. Does this thing change colour depending on how close I am? Or is it always going to be this colour? No. Anyway. Bonk. Okay, good, good, good. I remember all this. <laughs> Such sounds. As long as I get goods and perfects. Ooh, 24%. Nice. And now we got the fish. Took me a while to learn this too, but... With the power of, uh... Nonsense. That was awful. What a terrible cut. <laughs> Two stars. Yeah, a bit better. Blah, blah. Not good. <laughs> One star. That's a terrible gutting. Yeah, I like you, care. Good job. Collecting in the first long line. Emission waypoint has been blah, blah, blah. Must be picked up before the 48 hours have elapsed or else the line will be lost. The colour of the buoy. You got it, Captain. Whoa. Ah. And the boat shows me how much fish I can carry on this thing. Because now there's a little yellow gauge where the boat picture is. You know, the first thing I want to do is get a better engine. Because this thing only goes to eight, eight to nine miles per hour, which is not good, really. Or maybe it is. I don't know how... I don't know how quickly boats should travel. Because surely there's a uh, an integrity point. There has to be some kind of... You don't want to go too fast, or else the hull will explode. This music is too epic for what's happening right now. Though I like it, it's funny. Okay. Coming up. You turn, babe. Go. Turning port. Oh no. I was too late. 
Although, this might be okay. I can salvage this. This is okay. Just gotta do this. It's <laughs> fuck too much. Come on. This is why I want a better engine. All right, stop the boat. It's good enough. It's not good enough, apparently. Right, fine. Let's reverse. We will reverse onto the back one. Right there. It does change colour. It becomes a little bit more green. Alright. Forward. This music does not fit up with what's happening. It's like trying to parallel park. Good. 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 One more. Good. All right, now we got them. Because that's important. Well, I tried my hardest and it didn't work. Fuck it. <laughs> Zero stars for that one. Okay. Unhauling your second line. This is the map interface. You can open using the folders, blah, blah, blah. Use the buttons of the custom waypoints located to the travel. Ow. The area of the map depends on the boat's radar. Consider upgrading it if you want to fast travel to locations you're already farther away. Oh shit, yeah, definitely. Head to Hammerfell Port. Decide a custom waypoint or fast travel there. Right. <laughs> it didn't do this to me before. Yes! 
It didn't do this to me before. When I finished the tutorial last time, it just froze. It was like, pull in the line. It's like, I don't know what you're talking about. What line? Where are we going? <laughs> But this is more like it. We've made we're making progress after an hour of this. Come on, turn. I'm definitely going to upgrade my radar if I can fast travel to places now. I didn't know that was an option. Okay, so I just point where I wanna go. And, yeah, now I just wait. Fuck yeah. I'm going to have a little sip. I wonder what there is to talk about. I'm going to open up the old Twitters. Let's see if we can get a conversation going. McDonald's hikes, <laughs> McDonald's hikes their menu prices as burger costs go up for the first time in 14 years. Fucking riveting news. How expensive are they now? How expensive is a burger? <laughs> it's gone up by 20p. <laughs> So, that means a cheeseburger, which used to be 99 pence, is now £1.19. You know, I'd been annoyed, but I uh, shouldn't really be eating. Shouldn't really be eating Mackies. Good old Maccas. Not all the time, it should be a treat. It's like, oh, it's been a couple of months since I've had a fucking Mackie. I'll go take a fucking... But never mind. Let's see what else is there. Berserk? Really? What is this? <laughs> He's just like me! Says the man who is absolutely nothing like Guts from Berserk. What is this? Why is this on the news? What the fuck? I need to investigate this further. Let me look at this. <laughs> um. Somebody called Niley scrolling through Twitter on his phone at 4 a.m. whilst lying in bed. Looking at him swinging the giant sword around, killing the apostles that uh, haunt him every night. We're so similar! <laughs> what?! And that cunning bastard Griffiths is exactly like your night shift manager at KFC. This is... This has to be a joke. There's no way he's taking this seriously. Oh god. <laughs> Good piece of news. What else? Uh, oh, Loch Ness Monster news? What are you talking about? Loch Ness Monster could possibly live in the Scottish freshwater Loch Ness. An incredible scientific discovery has been found. Oh, really? Really? <laughs> What's the discovery? Let's see here. Blah, 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 blah. I'll just keep skipping. Scientists at the University of Bath and the University of Portsmouth in the UUK and the University of Hassan in Morocco have found small plesiosaur fossils in a 10 million year old river system that is now Morocco's Sahara Desert. Fair, fair. What's this got to do with Loch Ness though? Skip, 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 skip. Pretty cool though. Desert fossils, badass. 
Uh, da, 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 da. Sharing exciting news. Started the excitement of Loch Ness Monster is plausible. But the uni added rather significant caveat that the fossil record suggests that after almost 150 million years that the last plesiosaur finally died. It's the same dinosaur 66 million years ago. Yeah. I don't understand what's the point of this art. What's the point of this article? It's scrappy stuff. Blah blah. blah. It's a bit controversial. Blah, blah, blah. People, the paleontologists, are always called the marine reptiles. Uh, this is this is crap. <laughs> this article is crap. It's nothing. It's just clickbait, and it got me. It got me. Um. Yeah. There's uh nothing left to say. There is nothing significant about this article. Unfortunate. I thought we were gonna get something interesting. Alright, what else have we got? What other news do we have that isn't depressing? Oh yeah, this was um, posted in the Discord. I didn't get a chance to read it. So let's have a look. You can finally send friend requests from the Nintendo Switch Online app. What? Why is that news? <laughs> Why is that news? I'm not fucking reading that. Piss off. <laughs> that's fuck. That's nothing. It's nothing. That's not news. Why is that? Uh. <laughs> Yugi is trending. Yu-Gi-Oh. Yeah, apparently. Uh. I don't know why it's trending. Nothing significant has happened. I think it's just... I think it's just lucky that a lot of people were talking about Yu-Gi-Oh! at the same time and it's created a... a trend. What's this? You won't believe it's not plastic! The new subs sustainable packaging! Is it about the stuff I already know? The plastic you can eat? It looks like cling film, stretches like cling film, and does the same job at protecting a st stock cube from bacteria. The wrapper is not made of plastic, but it's actually made of pea protein. When you cook it, it dissolves. Okay. Others include Notbla, which makes transparent sachets from seaweed. And the Magical Mushroom Company, uh, which grows a polystyrene like material out of... What's this word? Agri uh, agricultural waste and fungi. I've seen these, actually. I have seen these mold covers that are like polystyrene, that are made out of fucking mushroom and plant material. I have seen these. So yeah, cool, we've got all these plastic replacements, so let's get, uh, you know, let's get a move on. <laughs> Haste makes waste. Okay, where are we now on the map? We have barely moved an inch. <laughs> this boat there is piss. Oh my god, you can fa- Look at that. If you set a waypoint, you can open the map and start a fast travel. And it just flies right towards it. Holy shit. Well, at least I had a break from the game for a sec. We read some news articles and such. Oh, it's night time now. 
This is pretty cool. God, I need to get a... I need to get a better fucking engine. This is awful. It's so sluggish. I'm not after something speedboat-like, but... something with a bit more kick because right now two-thirds of my hull are filled with fish and it's weighing down my boat quite a bit I'm only going five miles per hour you know what, fuck this travel. Okay, congratulations on returning to Hammerfest again. To sell your fish, you should dock at the Hammerfell by entry, blah, 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 blah. Your reward! 10,000 Krona! So I got 30,000 Krona to mess with. Alright, alright. Come on! Botte! Go! Right. Oh, that's what it is. It's my hull, and I can damage it. Very good. Oh, I see. Yep, sell. Tutorial, set long line. Long line? Select yes below if you would like to do the next tutorial in order to learn how to set a long line. Yes. You need to set a long line. First, you should go to the fish market to bait one of your long lines. Hi. You're back? Oh, rock and roll. <laughs> okay. Uh, fish market. Fish prices? Uh, press the fish market button on the bottom, rot, and buy long lines. Select the unbaited long line and bait it with shrimp. You have been given the money to pay for it the first time. I don't know what I'm doing. Krill. Shrimp. Okay. Now you can go fishing. Exit the port. Go fishing. All right. Okay. If you say so, Mr. Willis. If you say so, Mr. Belvedere. I actually want a better engine, though, if that's not an issue. Bought their services. Nope. Purchase a new boat. Upgrades. God, I could waste all of my money. Wait a minute. HP? Is that all it does? So how do I go quicker? Is that just some... Do I have to get a new boat to go faster? Oh, that stings. Hmm. 
Hmm. Okay. You need to set sail out of the dock area before you're able to fast travel. Set sail away from the docking area. Thank you. Thank you very much. Open map. Find a good spot to set your line. What is a good spot? The fuck's happening with the map? Calm down! So we're going here? Okay, good. Oh. And then... Fast travel. Fuck yeah, mate. Set a long line by using the set line button at the gear menu in the lower left of the corner of the pad. Set the long line using the set line. The gear menu in the bottom left corner. I don't see any gears. Okay, set long line, shrimp. Oh shit, slow down! Uh, now that you've set your first long line, you need to wait a minimum of four hours before you can pick up. For the purposes of this tutorial, we'll skip forward 20 hours good god 20 hours is the optimum time of a long line okay so <laughs> haul in the long line you got it back captain Arr, this game is tricky I wonder if this is what it's really like to be a bot there man Oh my long line. Perfect. 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 Good. Good. Hey, Snoop. I'm fishing. Good. 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 All right, now we got the fish. Now you should deliver your catch to the hammer fest to complete this tutorial. <laughs> Would you like to gut the fish? Yes. <laughs> of course I would. That's strange how it says, would you like to gut the fish? It's like, I, I don't have a choice, I have to. <laughs> no, that was an awful gutting. Good thing this is so low poly. Oh, there we go. Okay, deliver the catch to Hammerfest. You got it. 
Is that waypoint? And fast travel. Something is blocking your ability to fast travel. Oi! Fuck off! Gone! That's my horn. Hey! Move! Fucking ass wipe, fine. I'll take myself. Well, I'm going to be doing this the entire way. This game is very long-winded. Even with the fast travel option, this is still very, um... This is still very time-taxing. It's almost midnight. So why does it look like dusk? Whishing. Mission complete! I got rewarded 15,000 kronik. Dr. Port. <laughs> From this point on, you're on your own. Good luck. Thank you! No! Oh, my hole. My precious hole. Now, raw, sell it. Oh, it looks like it's the end of uh, that pirate playlist. I'm going to have to find a new one. Let's see. Ah, here we go. Let's try this. It'll roar it. So I've got 90,000 crot. How much is a new bote? Ten thousand. How do I check the speed? If it has a speed, even. Length, additional. Fucking yazzy. Oh, speed. There we go. Twelve knots. Seven knots. Teen. Teen. 16 30 Well, that's a very expensive boat Fifteen teen Eleven Fifteen, but these are huge ships though Fourteen Teen <laughs> Eight, but it's a gigantic thing the Hermes! Fuck! This thing's huge! Huge but fast though. You know, I want the Yezzy! Yeah. I don't have the money for it though. That's the boat I already have. Okay. That's fine. Um, What is this now?
Purchase a boat, upgrades, maintenance. Yes, I will lock. Thank you. Yeah, I'd like to uh, get some fuel. And repair me ship. Thanks. What is uh, upgrades? So if that's all storage does, I was really hoping that the engine would increase our knots slightly, but it just says HP. That bites. What if it doesn't though? What if it does upgrade our speed? You know, I'm gonna go for it. I've got the cash. I'm gonna go for it. Don't know what it's gonna do. I'm also gonna buy... Radar upgrade. Because I've got a feeling that would be useful. And I'll buy another storage unit. Boat services. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. The fucking bear. The bank. Oh, yeah, I can hire a crew. I'm not interested, though. For starters, I don't have a boat big enough. Fish prices. Long line. What do we got? So, our boat there is Pollock. There it is. So, we want mackerel. Yes. Yes, we want mackerel. Good. Fuck. Buy our boat there and head mounted camera do a real fishing stream I would never get on the boat ever fucking terrifies me Pollock is all the way out there let's do it Let's get out of the port first, because that little piece of, that little piece of, uh, oh, fuck my boat, fuck, ah, oh, just made it, that little piece of dock right there, it's stopping me from fast traveling anywhere, yeah, I hate boats in real life, no fucking way, I'd sooner get on a plane than I ever would a boat. I am not fit for the sea. The ocean has made it fundamentally clear that we're not welcome as a species and I aim to respect that warning. But I live on an island, yeah. Sucks to be me. Sucks to be me. The hell is that thing? I think it might just be a light. I was thinking about it. Something sparkly in the distance. Okay. Let me try this again. Aha! Go. And now uh, we woohoo! -hoo. 
Aren't all land masses technically Orlands? Orland. Okay, um... Yeah, let's get going. Lay maces. Orland. Eggs. So then, I set my gear. The one. And then I boat forward. And it's done. Um, the, the tutorial claimed that 20 hours is the most optimal time for coming back to one of these things. So... Hmm. That's a lot to see. This island's hu this 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 is fucking huge. I don't know how to waste time in this game. Let me think. What if I just zip back and forth? Just a little bit. Yeah, two miles. Okay, so that took about four hours, give or take. So if I put it here... And then go back. It has most definitely been 20 hours. In fact, it might have been a bit too long, but that's a okay. Let's go get our kitch. Fog the waves of boat. You know what? I do think the engine has made us better because we're moving at 14 miles per hour now. So I think the engine does make us go quicker. That's strange that it does because they didn't mention it. Hello. Hello, good old frook. Where is my loin? Where's me loin? Oh, thank you for the follow. Where is my line? It says right here. But I don't see it. Oh, wait, no, now I do. Okay, slow it down. Yeah, I'm long lining. I'm long lining the best to my abilities. Oh shit. <laughs> Come on. Get straight. Come on, come on, come on. <laughs> Inch forward a bit.
Okay. Reverse. line up oh my god I am nowhere near any of this I'll tell you what let's get far back I need a I need a long breath cod is the best fisherman to long line for long line I'm running out of fuel no I'm not there's I'm three notches down Come on, boat! You gotta start moving. I gotta make the quota. These waves aren't helping. Slow it right down. Almost to a crawl. The slowest of slow can be. Good. Good. Okay, stop. I said stop. No. Ugh. Fuck. Reverse. Just a little bit. Go. Yikes. Perfect. Only three fish. Good. Good. Oh well. Would you like to gut the fish? Yes. Yes, I would. Yeah, it's alright. It's funny, the ones I just sort of wing get better stars. The ones I try? Nothing. Bizarre. Oh, that was crap. <laughs> that was... really crap. Let's go here, for fun. Okay. Let's see what this place is like. I think you made a quota of cod before this game. In this game. I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm just checking this out for today. I'm probably not going to return to this game. Leafage. Different boat days and beat the port. That's bizarre. There's a weird dithering effect on the water when I do this. That is strange. Oh well. You know, there is something about this game I'm a bit confused about. If it encourages me to waypoint travel, something is blocking your ability. A 
What the hell? That was weird. Uh, your favorite thing about this game is the crabbing. Come on, boat. I feel like I'm piloting glass when I move this thing. Uh, oh yeah, my my rants. If this thing encourages me so strongly to waypoint travel, then why have the option to move at all? Okay. What's happening to my boat? Oh, it's being strung back! With these lines, I see. I was starting to panic. Um, doesn't offer upgrades, and does not offer boats. That's fine. I just want fuel. Uh, they have the selfie for small crabs uh, pots, and the large boats. And large crab pots. Okay. Let's try and uh, 40k. I think I can afford that. I can afford that though. Okay. Hmm. And I can go again. And I can go again. Fuck yeah. Let's get some snippies. Also, there is a little bit of a, um... An unintelligible... Uh... There is a little bit of an unintelligible thing with this game. A lot of... A lot of things that you would imagine to be... What the fuck? Do I have to physically leave the port before I can fast travel? Because that seems bizarre. This game has very specific rules. Very finicky specific rules and it's very strange. Stop. <laughs> Fuck. Yes. Okay. So then we just sort of... Put a bunch of these everywhere and come back later. Gear needs to be deployed 50 meters away. That makes sense. Defishing the ocean. Digimon. This way. <laughs> I 
<laughs> there we go. You just mash it, <laughs> it gets there. Okay. Now the game said 20 hours. And I believed it last time. I really did. One, two, almost three. Start zooming places. Why not? <laughs> Ten hours. So nine o'clock tomorrow morning. is optimal. Goodness gravy. You know, I just realized something. There's a better way of doing this. You could, I could have gone back to the port and just skipped time forward and then come back. That is an option. Start doing it now. I noticed that the boys started changing colour over the course of the day. Red, green, blue. I'm going to assume that red is no, green is perfect, and blue is... probably not so good. But it's fine. I need to find what I'm looking for to begin with. Oh, there they are. I see them. Yes, yes, yes. I couldn't quite see them, but now I do. up. Inch a little forward. Just a little bit. A bit more. I think that's good. Yeah, it says so. Yo, there's 12 fish on this one. Holy crap. All right. Perfect. 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 Good. Perfect. Good. 
good. Oh, okay. Oof. It's my first okay and I don't like it. Good. Perfect. What's happening with the line? Oof, okay. Good. Yes, I would like to gut them. Yes, I would like to gut the fish. Thank you. I wonder if you could get an aimbot for this. I programmed an aimbot so I could gut the fish perfectly in Big Fishy Foo Simulator. Okay, let's go get the other ones. I just noticed we started to drift away during that. Strange. Okay, slow the rot the heck in. I don't trust this boat. Now it's back to being green again. I wonder if green is not optimal. Why am I... What the fucking hell? What the fuck? That's more like it. Go! Twelve fish! <laughs> I'm not optimal. Perfect! Good. Perfect. 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 I don't know what the percentages mean. Perfect. It probably told me. Perfect. All the fish are rolling off. Perfect. 56%. That's my highest jet. Don't know what it means. You thought for a moment this game was playing scary music, then you realised you have your own music playing. Yeah, because the music in this game's weird. It's creepy. That's a lot of fish. Fuck. But we still got one more boy to pull in and then we can sail home. I'm running out of fuel, I've just noticed.
I wonder if I've got enough fuel to get back and sell these. I'd like to play an online fishing game with somebody, but it would have to be entertaining. Can't just be like this. There'd have to be like an end goal, a meat goal, a goal pole. Hold the line. Good. Perfect. 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 Okay. Storage is full. Oh my god! I'm taking a water. <laughs> Maybe if we got the fish, we could get rid of some of the weight. We could try out the new Bigfoot map when it comes out. Oh, yes. Yes, indeed. Fucking yeah. Oh. Fucking Yellowstone, ain't it? <laughs> we are overtaking on water. We're too heavy. We gotta get home. <laughs> oh, damn. All right, then. Here it is. They should add fishing into Bigfoot. <laughs> Welcome to Bigfoot fishing. Whoa! Hold on to your mothers. We're sinking. I think we're okay. I think if we had any more weight, though, that'd be an issue. It's just enough. Fuck! There's so much fish on the fucking boat. <laughs> it's so slow. Sell all these fish and I'll probably make a dime. This game, much like all the other fishing sim games I've played, it's very good. I'm very impressed with it, but it is way too much like real life than it is a video game. Because I imagine this is what it's like. You know, you've got a big ass fucking boat that weighs like a th three tons, and you've got to gently fucking needle thrill it to the docks, otherwise it'll cost you 50,000 cronies just to fix it. And it takes all day just to park your fucking boat. <laughs> I imagine that's exactly what it's like.
Seal. Okay. Just fishing, about to try to strike you, but instead pulls out a fishing rod of fishes with you. Bigfoot comes at you and screams at you in the middle of fishing. Ah! Why, Bigfoot? Why? What's this? Accept job. Cod. Do it within seven days. I don't really want to put responsibilities on myself. I've got less. I've got an hour left on this stream. I kind of just want to fuck around and catch fish, you know. This game is way too slow for me. Way too slow. So damned with the consequences. Um, uh, services, yeah, refuel. And I guess, repair my hull. Let us get the best engine you have. Oh, do I have to buy them in order? Boo. I can't just skip. Boo. Boo, Ben. Boo, Ben can on boo. You should add a Florida swamp map and have you hunt the skunk ape. I hope that's something they're gonna do. Because we've got forest, we got snow, now we've got uh, Yellowstone, which is like an arid region. There's still forest, but there's like dry patches here and there. It's like a... Well, I already said it. Arid region. So, yeah, having a swamp map. I'd be fucking down for that. Definitely. Most definitely, yes. Please do. The fuck is happening? Majestic. One should be in the Himalayas. Or like, no, no forests, just... <laughs> just mountains and caves and shit! <laughs> Very good. <laughs> That's hysterical. Hey, Bader. Hey, Bader. Alright. Well, it looks like my quota on redfish is, like, really down, so I should, uh... Probably do something about this pollock, yes? Probably do something about this pollock, yes? Didn't I fuck you two up in the ice cave? I actually don't remember, but luckily we recorded it all and it's all online, so we can probably find out really easy. But the only thing I remember is what I put in the... the clip highlight video. Those bits, those bits made me laugh the most, so I remember them. But I'm afraid of the specifics. I just don't know. Okay, Jackson Pollock. There we go. Well, that does mean we're going to have to go out and do that thing again. It's fine, we've got an hour. What else are we doing? 
Let's see if this engine's made my boat a bit better. It actually is. Look how... That's actually pretty quick. That's a significant upgrade. Oh, damn. Not bad. Yeah, but the Himalayas will be completely different landscape. An abandoned city map would be cool. An abandoned city? How would that work? I don't have it. It's not ready because I need to wait for the end of the year in case any more interesting shit happens. But it is in. I have a big folder of which clips I'm going to make the highlight out of. And near the end of the year where I take the week off, I'm going to make the video. And then on New Year's Day, I'll upload the video like I did last time. But uh, there's still half a year to go. And more clips can happen. More funny moments can happen. Okay. The Pollock. Really like to live down here. I, I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to set a waypoint. Yeah, set a... Set a waypoint. Oh no. Baffin! You bitches! The Bote AI is not good. Set a waypoint. Float around there for a bit. Uncover more of that land. See how much that area reaches with the Pollock. And then we can do more. Could have it so that the city is big with a park in the center. Uh, work your way out from the middle of the peak of the map in the city being reclaimed by nature. It's Bigfoot being the what kind of city? How how um how modern are we talking? Are we saying this city's like from the eighteen hundreds? Seventeen hundreds? What aesthetic is the city going to take? Are we talking ancient city? Made of stone and shit. You love the moment in that fishing game where MatPat came into your stream and started to explain all the lore of fish to me. That didn't happen, I think. I don't remember that. in the lore, fish in the lore. This boat is better. I can go up to 16 miles per hour with this thing, so the engines do make you faster. They really should say, though. Like, really? Also, it says King Crab. Modern because you can do cool shit with its imagined luring Bigfoot or the building onto you. The dodge is charged and he falls off the building. It would have to be a pretty high building. Um, if you remember, if you remember, Bigfoot can take a pretty big fall in that game. I remember falling off a cliff when I was playing as Bigfoot in the Frosty map, and I took hardly any damage. So, yeah, it'd be viable, but it would have to be significantly high to do anything, like, respectable. Isn't that actually a reclaimed city somewhere in the US, like the 20th century? I don't know. Some machinery can still work and be used as distractions. Oh, yeah, yeah. Like, you turn on a sand belter or something and he brings him near.
like a metro system and he's roaming the tunnels. That's fucking scary. Fuck. Fuck that. That's terrifying. I hate that. I hate imagining that. That's scary. But it would work. Okay, this entire area is Pollock. More reason to have it. It's a good idea, but I hate it. I hate it in the good way. Twenty-five meters. All right. Now what I do is turn my ass around and I start tapping the shit out of this to get the most optimal result. There it is. That would be fucking terrifying though. Running around the running around the subway tunnels of an abandoned city. Shit. I want them to eventually uh, do a Skinwalker Ranch uh, map. I know that's like, that's not Bigfoot, that's Skinwalker, I know, but it just feels right, you know. Also, Bigfoot, Bigfeet have been spotted at Skinwalker Ranch, supposedly, so it still works. But don't call it Skinwalker Ranch, call it the actual name of the place. I forget what the actual name of the place is, but it's got a name. It's got an epic name. <coughs> also, they could probably try and do a deserty location like Wild Westy map and do like a sand squatch. <laughs> a fucking desert ass squatch running around. Bigfoot game is kind of rooted in reality somewhat, and there doesn't seem to be any entire cities reclaimed by nature. In the US, at least. Aww. Well, I, best, I suppose the best we could hope for is, like, something similar to what they did with the, with the other two maps, where there's, like, a miniature town. But maybe, I don't know. There, wait, there are plenty of old forts in the US from the Civil War they had. Lots and lots of old brick, mortar, and concrete forts that have been left over from the war. They might be able to do something with that. Bigfoot sightings in Scheme Walker Ranch would be viable. I think it'd be fun. To have like a one-to-one -one map of Skinwalker Ranch to walk around in. That'd be fucking creepy. Fuck that. <laughs> I say that I say fuck that in the funnest of way though. It'd be scary, but yes please.
Isn't the new game from the Witch Dev out this year? The game's already out to buy and purchase. It is a... What do they call it when they release it when it's not done? Um, early access. Um, the game is early access and I've got it in my Steam library. I got it cheap before, you know, the price hacked up because of the newer content. Um, I don't know when it's going to be finished. I know he's always adding stuff to it, but I'm going to wait. Because I don't want to play through the game be like that was great and then come back a month later and he's said i've added the ending and then i gotta play through the game again just doesn't seem like a good idea to me so i'm gonna wait until he's finished it we got version one out <laughs> version one a finished product then i'll play it but i'm gonna wait i'm gonna wait because from what i've seen there is actually a story in that game that he wants to use. Much like how Witch Hunter had a story. There was like a progression and shit. But I got it. I got it. And I've seen people play it too. It looks terrifying. It looks fucking terrifying. There is one thing I'm a little bit... I'm, uh, there is something I'm nitpicky about, though, and it's totally a me thing, but the skinwalker that he used in his game is the one with the skull and the horns, and it, it kind of annoys me because it's like, that's not, that's not what a skinwalker looks like, that's not, that's not, that's not Native American lore, that's incorrect, that's fucking creepypasta shit. So, if they actually looked like how the Native Americans describe them, I'd be all for it. But it looks... It just doesn't look right. I don't like it. It's like, it's still scary, but when I see it, I'm like, ah... Kinda, kinda cringe. Bit cringe. Um, that game would be great with co-op. It would. There is, there are games like that, that are co-op. There's a game called Folklore Hunter that's very similar. Where you hunt vampires, werewolves, stuff like that. And it's co-op. So you can join up with a buddy and hunt down a mythological beast. And there's a lot more, there's a lot more stuff like that. Um, Skinwalker Ranch, the final map, after you kill Big's feet, your van drives away, a Skinwalker comes out of the bushes. Sometime late, uh, later the devs announce Skinwalker, where you hunt and capture a Skinwalker. Fuck that. Fuck that. Bigfoot's one thing, but Skinwalker's like... ...an intelligent creature, it's a human. It's, it's a human, it's a witch doctor. That'd be, like, super intelligent. Bigfoot is smart, sure, but he's more animal than smart. Hunting a skinwalker, fucking Christ. Fuck that. No thank you. Still, though, lots of cool stuff to do. It would be more scary. It would! That's why I don't want to do it! It would outsmart you. Do something you wouldn't expect. Uh, yeah, 
Yeah, 64 Pollock. Not bad. Hey, Peter. Hey, Peter. <laughs> Wait a minute, is this a Minecraft? It is. It's playing Minecraft right now. By the way, the video title of this video I'm using is called Calm Ocean Voyage D&D Ambience. And it's playing Minecraft. Nothing wrong with Minecraft music. But... Uh, I wouldn't play it. During a D&D session, definitely not. Mod Bigfoot to be Sasquatch model is just replaced by Peter Griffin. <laughs> That'd be pretty funny, actually. We go back to bit. We go back to playing Bigfoot and we replace him with Peter Griffin. Rot in the green. I think I might need to be towed back. Because I've just saw I just saw my fuel and I don't think it's enough to get home. But we'll try. We'll creep on trying. I'm trying to think of other locations that would be good for that Bigfoot game. Yellowstone's great. That would have been... That would have been a good idea. That is a good idea, excuse me. Because, you know, Yellowstone has Bigfoot sightings. Uh, Florida swamps, like you said. Good idea. A swamp map would be good. Um, Skinwalker Ranch. I'd like that. Um, I want the city idea because the idea of running through tunnels with barely any light is fucking terrifying. So maybe there's like a way we can get around that. There has to be like some underground tunnels abandoned somewhere in the US of A. Maybe connected to an old fort or some shit? I don't know. Anywhere where Bigfoot has been sighted is viable. I know, but I'm thinking of, like, maps that mix the game up. Because we don't want another forest map. We've already got one. We want new maps with new locations, with new atmospheres and new... ...things. And America's got a lot of landscapes. Oh well. We don't know how long they're going to keep that game running for, but I'm glad they're back. I'm glad they're back and, you know, alive. Rock and roll! One more fishing joint to go. And where is it? It says it's right here, but I don't see it. Oh, there it is. I see it now. Also, I've bought 
Yeah, I bought all of those cosmetic DLC stuff for the Bigfoot game. Not because I wanted them in a particular way, just uh, I wanted to help them. It can't be easy. Also, more money for them means more stuff in the game. The fact they're still working on it amazes you. Yeah, seriously. Good on them. Really impressed. Really impressed, and it's a fun game, and it's scary. That's the achievement. It's actually scary. You know how goddamn hard it is to make a scary game these days? Hall. I suppose that is at least takes their minds off what's going on. Yeah, if anything, it's a project they can work on. A project that has uh, that has fruits because people are playing it, people are buying it. It's very encouraging to know that something you work on and you have proof, evidence in some form that people like it and they want you to continue. Make more, please. I know you just finished Yellowstone map, but can we have more? More maps. More maps the better. And also, can we have different types of big feet? Because we got regular Bigfoot from the forest, we got uh <laughs> we got an albino Bigfoot for the snow map. Just give him different hair, that's all I'm saying. Have a ginger Bigfoot. <laughs> Okay, that's all the fish I can grab. I think we'll be okay. You know, I was worried about not being able to, um... Not being able to make it back, but I think we're gonna be okay. Go! Yeah, it looks like we're going to have just enough fuel. Or we're going to get there and run out of fuel. <laughs> One of the two. Um, where is the dock? That's oh, right there. If they're just in, if they're just inspired, they could take some creative liberties. Make a place based on an overgrown area with explorable Cold War bunkers. That could work. Yeah, that could work. Some underground bunkers that got left behind by the military, and a Bigfoot found its way in there. <laughs> Eating all the leftover rations and shit. Fuck. This boat is heavy. This boat is heavy. Oh, 
I would still like the city idea though. I do still like the city idea, but now that you mention it, it's kind of it's going to be tough. Still though, we don't know what they're going to do. They might do all of the realistic locations like, you know, Yellowstone, uh, National Forest in Utah, the fucking Frosty Mountains, all that shit, you know, they, they do all the obvious places. But then they just might go through a phase where we're like, fuck it, and they do like a space map. <laughs> you know what I mean? They don't have to make sense. Oh no! <laughs> My boat. It got smushed. Yeah, repair. And fuel. Military bunkers also tend to have underground railway tunnels. That could work. These are all good ideas. I like them. I like them. I like these ideas you're pitching to me. But here's a... I've got a different idea for you. Ready for this? What if... What if... Big Burger... Big Burger running around. Especially from that era. Yeah, definitely. It could work. You know, now that I've said space map as a joke... Could you imagine... A joke map they do where you're running around on Mars <laughs> and it's like a it's a Mars space station and there are moments where you can go outside and you're running around these Mars tunnels and there's a fucking Mars ape <laughs> a Mars Yeti he's got bright red fur <laughs> cold war cold war it wasn't cold at all from battery <laughs> It wasn't cold at all. Yeah, look at my quota. I'm, uh, I'm getting really close to actually finishing my my quota. It's pretty good. Let us do one more round of this. Let's mix it up though. Let's do Pollock. Sorry, not Pollock. Redfin. Another Pollock. And... I guess this one? Nah, it's just shrimp bait. Yeah. Also, is there any more crap we can buy from the shop here? Like a better engine? Yes, yes there is. Best engine the boat can give me. And I don't think I can buy anything else. Uh, yeah. Searchlights don't really need those. Masts. I could buy all of those. Don't even know what they do. Okay, let's go. Let's make this the last fishing trip of uh, the stream. I'll finish off my quota and then I'll be like, cool. Put the game down forever. It's a very good game. It is. But much like the other fishing games I've played, they're just not for me. Go back to the spot, it looks like. 
That looks like the best area. Okay, we need to leave the harbour though. And also I got the best engine now. So we should be... Fucking booking it from this point on. Okay, I think we've left the harbour enough for me to do this. Yes. And yes. Alright. Go, boat! Alright, good. Now I know in this area there's a bunch of shit we can east so I'm gonna do, go ahead and do that but first I want to at least turn around yes there it is kissed go Turn around slightly. <laughs> Spam this. There we go. Ah, yeah, good, good. it is. Now we just gotta wait for them all to turn blue or green or greeny blue. So I'll just be doing this for a while. I can zoom all the way over there and then zoom all the way back. Go! Alright, none of them have turned red. <laughs> That's scary. So how about... How about I... Oh, fuck. Shit. Fuck! I think my catch is gonna be ruined. They're all blue. If I go back, they're all gonna be gone. I think I've ruined it. I don't have enough fuel for this. I don't have enough fuel for this. I'm gonna have to be quick. As quick as one can be. Yes, I want to exit the port. And now I need to leave the line. Oh god, all of my fish. Fuck the hole! Reverse! Reverse. Reverse. I'm panicking! I just need to exit the box. Yes. Oh no. 
Oh, they're going to be bad. They're going to be bad. They're going to be so bad. Oh, God. They're all going back. Okay. We have no choice now. We have to. We have to hook these suckers. We have to. I'm so stupid. We're going to get so little fish from these. Okay, there's one. Yes. Fuck. There's not going to be many fish, is there? Oh, 11, actually, never mind. This is okay. I thought we were only going to get like four or something, but this is okay. I just want to see what happens when I reach my quota. Do I get like a little -ba -da 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 or something? It's like, well done! Here's our money! And I'll be like, oh god, it's all so sudden. Good. Um, where's the next one? Ha! There it is. These lights are made for something. Go! Good! Perfect! Good! Good. 
god. Good. I think I've definitely reached my quota, but we won't know until we make it back to port. The the lights of the boat is making the blood look like feces. Um, okay, the music's run out. What have we got that will do for now? Coastal village music. All right, let's fucking do it. Why are these fish so covered of shit? It is a cool game, it is. I would recommend this to anybody who is a huge fan of fishing. Absolutely, this is very impressive. Keep you busy for hours. Give me that gravy! Little bit too... enthusiastic. But it's okay, we can recover. Some big reversing, like big boys. And put the throttle forward and try again. This boat doesn't half take five fucking minutes to start moving. Okay, line it up, line it up. Inch slowly forward. And we got it. Let's head back. And hopefully I've met the quota. It's cool how all these fish come out of the water with where to cut them already on their skin. Very handy. That's evolution at its finest. So, uh, 
here? Oh! <laughs> Pressing the wrong button. Excuse me? That was weird. That was very strange. Okay, go! Wait. Remove that one. No! Go! Don't bump into any more boats along the way. Nice. Whoa, shit. I turned off. I fucking smacked the microphone. Whoops. I'm just so excited to sell these fish. It looks like I've met it. Hmm. What the heel? What is happening? What is happening here? Well, not as climactic as I thought it was going to be. That's a shame. Because it, it looks like we have met the quota. All of the bars are greyed out. We've caught all the fish that we can. Legally allowed to, at least. I was expecting something. It's like, well done, you, you fulfilled this license. Here's a... But nothing happens. Just like real life. You, you fill out that rewards card on your subway and you fill in all eight stamps and you're expecting a little fanfare that's like pew you get a free sandwich wait wait but in reality you get nothing it's just the card that's stamped in this truly is a simulator yeah well we're done with this I gave this game a lot of time and I liked it. I liked this game a lot, but Oh, shut up music. I gave this game oh, stretching, excuse me. Yeah, I gave this game a lot of time. Uh I liked it. It's a really good fishing simulator. It's probably the best one I've played yet. It's very impressive. Um, but it's it's not for me. And I've, we've, we've, we've done this so many times. I'm way more into the video gamey types of fishing games than real life. But that's, that's impressive. Fishing Barnett's Sea is impressive. So then. Yeah, I'm going to end the stream a bit early. But uh, we'll be back tomorrow 
Tomorrow's Thursday, right? Let me check. It is. Tomorrow's Thursday. So tomorrow I'm going to go back to Klonoa. And we're going to mash out as many blue exits as we can and get all of the art pieces in the art gallery. So thank you everybody for tuning up today. It was good. And I hope you have a good rest of the day. I'll see you all soon. Goodbye. Have a beautiful day.